So the Division Patch 1.2 is out with all the new gear sets, but I find myself using an old gear set. I'm talking about Sentry. Now they nerfed Sentry so that you need to have a semi-automatic weapon in order for it to actually proc. But that's okay. I'm kind of a kind of I'm the kind of guy who likes to hang back and use a marksman rifle. And occasionally, well, that's really the only semi-automatic weapon that I use. But I really wanted to try out this sentry set, so I went ahead and I stacked my sentry for toughness and armor and health. I, roll, I, I uh, re rolled it for a bunch of stamina and some armor bonuses, and I got up to about 315. These are all 214, 191, and 182 gear sets, so this isn't by any means close to like, like the top tier end game gear that you can get. So you can go ahead and do this yourself, it's, it's pretty easy. But what you want to roll is stamina and armor because in reality, that's all you need for this set. What's my goal? I got myself a little shotgun because, you know, since I only use marksman rifles, I got to use a shotgun because the sentry only works with shotguns, marksman rifles, and pistols. So I need to learn how to use a shotgun. But my goal with this set is two things. One, stay alive, which is why I'm rolling all the armor in the helmet. And two, I need to make sure that I, you know, I mark the end. And that's what the deal is with the shotgun. Because believe it or not, the shotgun is going to allow you to get marked a lot easier than a marksman rifle or a shotgun. So I'm using health, uh, first aid, and I'm using the sticky. But I'm also using the one is none. This, I got this idea from the porn star. I'll put his link to the, his channel in the description. You're probably already subscribed to him because he's a pretty amazing YouTuber. Uh, he's a pretty cool guy to watch, but uh, I also have um, you know reduced skill cooldowns because I have a really low skill and I want to do everything I can to get my skill cooldowns better. Which means when I'm at low health, I'm also going to be able to get a faster cooldown on my skills. But anyway, these are my loadouts. So, so how do you play this? It's like I said before, you got a lot of toughness, and you got the sentry build. So how do you play it? You play it by using your shotgun in close range because you have high toughness to take down enemies or not really take them down but to triple mark them that's the goal triple mark enemies and move on to the next enemy you're not there to kill them you're there to triple mark them now this is mostly a pve build because well i don't really play pvp all that much it's kind of i don't know there's too many griefers so i i, I, I tend to stay away from there plus i'm usually a solo player so we are getting ready to match make um, for your dailies and you're on the challenge mode everybody's gonna be trying to run DPS high DPS whatever this is why I like to do something different I like to run tactician so I can heal people constantly or in this case my tanky sentry so I can mark everybody down I can triple mark all the enemy and it makes it easier for my teammates to kill people and we're not wiping as much on shotgunners on Russian consulate because the shotgunners are easily melted by my teammates once I triple mark them. So there you go. In the background, speaking of Russian consulate, there is some footage of me using this setup and how to use it. And it's really great. With the one is none perk, your shotgun, any little pellet guts on the head, you're marking them. And you also have the opportunity to not use that bullet. It stays in the magazine. And that's important. So um, this is something Pornstar was talking about. You don't have to get a high capacity magazine. Instead, you can just concentrate on the rate of fire and reload speed, which is cool. But the thing about this is your shotgun and your marksman rifles, and yes, your pistol, they kind of need to be high rate of fire, but also have the accuracy to hit people in the head. And I'm, I'm sure you've had this experience when you have those high rate of fire marksman rifles. It's really hard to get consistent headshots. But with the shotgun, it's a lot easier. So there you go. This is my build. It's a sentry build. You want a lot of toughness with armor and health. And you want to run a shotgun, marksman rifle, and pistol. So you can mark the crap out of everybody. If, that, if, if your health needs to come up with a yellow high-end glove or your other two sets are high-ends instead of uh, gear sets so be it but get your health up there so you can have that survivability to not let your team down and die while you're trying to mark people 
But there you go. That's all the time I have for today. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Leave a comment down in the comment section below, and I'll see you next time. Adios.